Hey what's up guys and welcome to another team of the season player review. Today we have this man team of the season Omar Al Sommer. He is of course from the brand new Saudi league team of the season and his card it has to be said does look pretty impressive. Now before we get into this review I have to say I did have high expectations of this card because his inform is incredibly overpowered. If you've tried inform all summer I'm sure you'll know what I mean. Also, I'm sure you will have heard some YouTubers refer to this guy as a cheap version of Ibrahimovic. Now, I don't necessarily agree with that as dribbling-wise, he is nowhere near on Ibra's level. But, I can understand the comparison as both are tall, strong and both have a great shot on them. Anyway, let's move on and talk about team of the season, Al Sommer's in-game stats. First of all, he's got 98 strength, which is awesome. In-game, he's very freaking strong. On the flip side of that, sadly, he does have 33 balance, which I've got to say wasn't actually that much an issue for me, but I understand it could be an issue for some people. Team of the season, Al Sommer does indeed have 90 shooting on his card, so as you can imagine, some very good shooting stats. First of all, he's got 92 finishing. In the box, he's very clinical. He's got 95 shot power as well, so he's got very powerful strikes, and also he's got 94 heading. So if you want someone to cross to, this guy would be ideal. Along with that 94 heading, you've got to remember this guy is also 6 foot 4 and on top of that he's got 89 jumping. So he's going to win most headers and probably will score you plenty of headed goals if you do indeed like to cross. And now let's talk about something that you guys know I love to talk about and that is of course his pace. Now I've got to say Al Summer does not feel slow as long as you are running in a straight line because as soon as you start moving about... He just feels a bit more sluggish on the ball. His ball control and dribbling just aren't that great in my opinion. He's definitely more of a target man striker than a creator. So do bear that in mind. Although I do have to admit his short passing is very good and his link up play wasn't too bad. A few more positives about this card include his positioning. I was pretty happy with that. He's also got pretty good long shots, which obviously is very nice. And also, he's got 95 free kick accuracy and good shot power. So if you need a set piece taker, this man could be your guy. There is one more thing I want to talk about before we get into the summary and that is this guy's reactions. For me, he was just always slow to react which as you can imagine was a bit frustrating especially since he was my lone striker. Anyway guys, it's time to summarise team of the season Al Sommer and overall I'm going to give him an 8.5 out of 10. Now I've got to say when I first picked this guy up at first he wasn't that great. He didn't do too much in the first two games but once I got used to him, got him involved a lot more he started scoring more. Just remember, use him as a target man. Don't use him to run through or at defences and you won't have too many issues with him. I've got to say, I don't think he'll be everyone's cup of tea, but uh, for me, once I got used to him, I did like him. Is he worth the coins? Currently, he's going for about 40 or 50k. I definitely think at that price, he's worth picking up and trying out. Anyway, guys, that is my review of Team of the Season all summer. Hope you have enjoyed this player review. If you have, please remember to leave a like on the video. Comment below who I should review next. Have a good day. Adios. Of his stride.